I'm gonna have to go back. Oh! Oh my god, let go of me. Let go of me. What the fuck, that scared the shit out of me. He just like grabbed onto me instantly. Also, this room looks very confusing. Ah! Oh my god. Okay, that works. I don't know why he didn't do it in the first place. Hey everyone, welcome back to Resident Evil uh, HD Remake. It's been about two months since I last recorded. Um, so I'm just going to jump back into it randomly like this. Uh, I moved and I started college, uh, my sophomore year of college. So a lot happened and I just kind of needed to take a break. Um, but I think I'm ready to start back in, so we're going to do that. Um, I have no idea what happened in the last one. Well, I, I looked at the end of the last video. Um, I think we killed the Medusa lady that was in this house, and we also uh, have the two stone and metal objects now to put in the little, like, right area under the staircase. Um, I Okay, let me just check that, if that's true. Oh, you could skip that cutscene? Oh, I wish I knew that beforehand. Um... Okay. Oh. Oh, the other one's in the, um... Yeah, it's in, it's in that thing that... It's in the doorway. Like, that door contraption that lets us go out into the courtyard in the back. How do I get out of here? <laughs> uh... Okay, there we go. Okay, so if there's a lady here who's trying to kill me, I'm gonna, like, lose my shit. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. So, I guess we're just gonna go back and do that. I don't know. I, I don't know when this game ends or, like, where the ending place is. So, I don't remember how to open the map. Not that. Okay, here we go. Um. So, yeah, we still have that, like, one section in the courtyard that's not open. It looks like we still have a lot to do, actually. Basement 2. I don't remember what's down there, honestly. Um, but let's go do the thing I said I was going to do. Also, like, if rooms aren't checked off completely, um, then that could just be because I left an item in that area. Also, I have a new setup. I have a new mon another monitor, so I'm looking over in this direction. This is where I'm playing the game from. Um... So, I have, my camera is over here right now because um, I don't have the detachable camera that I used to have. Where the fuck am I going? Okay, I need to go this way. This way. That way. Okay. No, oh, shit, shit, shit. Which way am I facing? <laughs> I don't even know which way I am facing. This, that's how, that's how like, confusing this game is with its camera angles. A lot of games do this. Okay. That's just a simple zombie, it doesn't move that fast. Um, if it did, I would be shooting my pants right now. Um, okay, I think this is the, like, courtyard that branches off from the main courtyard, possibly. Uh, you know how there's, like, two doors that bring you out into the courtyard? I think that's just the one on the, on the side. <sighs> okay, where am I? Oh, okay, I have to run through here. There's probably me crows. Oh, shit. Is that the one that, like, runs really fast? I think it is. <laughs> I heard its footsteps pretty fast. Um, like, this sounded pretty fast. Okay, yeah, this is the area with the dog statues and, like, the directional things. Um, so, okay. Okay, I think I'm starting to remember where I am. Go up here. Um, this is gonna like plop us out near like that portrait area. Like near the like when we get back into the mansion, we'll be like near the portrait area. <sighs> okay. Yeah, out here. Once we go through like this little section over here. Oh, do you remember the? I don't know if you guys remember, well, you probably did if you watched the last one, and you're watching this in the future, but, um, okay, yeah, let's take this back. Um, there's a bunch of lizard men everywhere, so, 
and that's inside. They're inside the mansion. Actually, I think there might be one in this room. <sighs> I need to just like run fast to the other side of this room. <laughs> this is. I I've been watching a lot of horror stuff lately, like American Horror Story and stuff. Um, American this season of American Horror Story is actually really scary. Um, I won't say what the theme is. I mean, a lot of people know what the theme is. It's the it's season ten, the second half. I don't know. A lot of it gets to me personally. <laughs> okay. Um, this way. Just like with the whole aliens thing, that's the theme. I mean, I feel like everyone knows that that's the theme. So, well, yeah, the aliens are really creepy. Ooh. Um. Okay. Now what? Now I need to go this way. I really hope this isn't just me running around a whole bunch this episode. Like, I actually want to get things done. <laughs> I feel like sometimes I just have episodes where I don't get a lot done, and it's just, like, I don't know, not as entertaining. At least, at least I wouldn't be as entertained. I mean, I'm, I can't really speak for everyone on this earth. There's tons of different people on this earth who like different things. So maybe there are people who just, like, watch me run around and talk about random stuff. <laughs> Uh, okay. So, use one and then the other. Can't believe we're finally gonna go down here. Oh my god, look at that. Oh god, I'm scared. I feel like this is the end of the game right here. I feel like I should go. S okay, I'm gonna go save in the dining hall room and then I'll be right back. Okay, so I saved. I I'm just realizing now. I don't even think we know where this goes because there's no map or like sub map for it. The two emblems fit neatly into the door. Open it. That's scary. Why why was there like special dialogue for this? Is this like a boss battle or something? Or, like the final boss? Where the fuck are we? Altar altar. Yeah, this has to be the end of the game. Come on. Oh, there's a typewriter I know mocks down here. Oh, was I supposed to save down here? <laughs> With an item box. Oh wait, it said that on the map. <laughs> why, why did I, what? <laughs> I don't know where my brain was right there. Oh. So, wait, what? Wait, huh? Wait, so, it says that, okay, so there's another staircase. It also says there's a branching path over here, but I can't, I can't take it. Oh, I'm scared. I don't know why, but I'm just very scared. Wait, is it only an item box? No, there's a typewriter in this room too. Um, what do I have here? I have a shotgun, shotgun shells. What else do I have? I have a handgun, self-defense gun. I feel like that's not that strong. My magnum revolver. Do I have any rounds left? Or no? I don't. Okay, so I should probably bring the handgun with me too. Oh, this is spooky. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Um, okay. I feel like that should be good. Maybe I should bring like a green herb with me. I probably should have made like a better healing item. <laughs> uh, but you know, this is already all I have. I also have the serum. I don't know if I can use that though. I think that's like a story thing. Okay. Well, I'm gonna leave. Actually, no. I'm gonna save, and then I'm gonna, and then I'm gonna put it, those back in there. Uh, that ink ribbon is what I'm talking about. I need to figure out where this typewriter is, though. Oh my god, this is spooky. Oh, there's another staircase. Oh, this is definitely this is definitely the final boss. Come on. Where's the typewriter? Is it down this way? Oh, did I miss it? Where where was it? Maybe it was back at the top of the stairs. I think this is the end, honestly. I think this is the end right here. And that kind of spooks me. Is that the typewriter? No, okay. That's nothing, apparently. Um, yeah, was it up here or something? Oh, it's literally, it's literally right here. <laughs> Okay, I'll save my progress. Even though I just did that. But if this is the end, I guess we can uh, afford it because we don't, we're not gonna eat them after this. Okay. I'm 
I'm spooked. I'm scared. Um, I maybe I should take the knife or something. I don't know. Should we take the? I mean, the knife is probably gonna be better than the self-defense gun just because um, I can use it more times. Although it will be harder to use. Um. So yeah, let's take the knife. Oops, oops, not that, not that. Okay. I'm afraid about what's gonna be down here. I think we're I think we're done though. This is the last I think this is the boss battle. This looks like a boss battle area. I, just, I know I've said that like so many times that I know I'm repeating myself. I'm someone who repeats myself a lot, if you can tell from my videos. <laughs> okay, let's go. Mmm. I'm scared. I feel like this is gonna be a um cutscene right here. Okay. Um, let's have a sense for these kind of things. Where am I? Oh, this is definitely... Th come on, this is definitely the final boss. This has to be. This looks like a final boss area. What is this? Oh, we're taking a ladder down. We are really below ground right now. I know it. You're a bit of a mess up. <gasps> Chris, take a piece of the action. I knew it was him. Oh, wait, okay, never mind. <laughs> um. Can you shoot her? I don't trust Wesker at all. I feel like it's him. I feel like he's one behind all of this. I'm honestly gonna let him, like. <gasps> oh! Did he die? Oh, shit. What the fuck? Holy shit, okay. Wait, I think he just, did he die? I didn't, I didn't see what happened. Um. Okay. It's another Medusa lady though. This is a spooky area. Are you dead yet? Wait, is she dead now? Oh, she's not. Oh shit. Uh, you're very slow with your swings. Where are you? How close are you to me is what I can't tell. Actually, how how good am I on ammo? <laughs> it's a good thing I checked. I don't think I could... Yeah, yeah, I'm out. I'm out. It's a good thing I checked at that exact time. Okay. Oh shit, I just fucked up. Oh shit, what the fuck? Oh shit. I'm gonna run around. Okay. Is she dead yet? Like, why? I don't wanna use my knife. Am I supposed to not kill her? Am I supposed to, like, run or something? Ow! Oh shit. Oh shit, she almost hit me twice. Okay. Die already, come on. Oh. Oh fuck, she can leap. <laughs> I mean she did that earlier, but she had it she didn't hadn't done it in so long. Am I supposed to kill her? I don't know what's going on here. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Shit shit shit. Okay, um, Oh, did I just die? Oops. <laughs> oh, uh, okay. I feel like this is the final boss though. So I feel like we're probably gonna die some couple times, you know, should be fine. Wow, I can't believe, I can't believe I stopped right before the final boss. Took a two month hiatus. <laughs> Sorry. Um. Hey, at least I'm finished it though, right? I think it's just good to see it in a good light. Is my phone going off? No, 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 my phone's on. Dis do not disturb at the moment. Also, my mic is moving a lot. So sorry if there's a lot of uh, feedback from that. In the darkness lies your fears. Okay. Um. Here, let me... There we go. That should be good. Uh. 
Okay. Well, maybe I should rework my strategy or something. I don't know. Or just not fight her. <laughs> I don't know. I kind of like feel like I'm not supposed to protect Wesker partially. Mm. I don't know how to kill her though. That's the problem. I'm gonna swap that out for that instead of the survival knife. Mm, excuse me. All right, let's go down and try again. I don't know what else to do. <laughs> um. Okay. Hmm. I hope you guys had a good two months, though. I had a decent two months. I wouldn't say it's a, they were amazing, but I wouldn't say they're terrible either. They had good and bad aspects. Aspects that cancel each other out, pretty much. Pretty much. Um, is there anything over here that I missed? Anything I can pick up? Or am I supposed to just come with what I got? I think I'm just supposed to come with what I got. Okay. Now, if there's another thing to fight after this, that's gonna suck. I kind of feel like there is going to be too. You're a bit of a mess up. Chris, take a piece of the action. I don't trust you. What if I shoot him? I can't. Wait, okay, before I waste all this again. Yeah, can you fucking shoot him too? Shoot her too, I mean. Oh wait, I need to see what happens here. Ow! Did she just hit me? Okay. Yeah, okay, so she knocked him off. Okay. <laughs> That's fine, I guess. I don't know. An iron grate blocks the path. There must be some way to open it. Okay, there's gotta be a way to, like, get around fighting her. No, 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 no. Like, I feel like there's something... Message has been carved into the sarcophagus. When the curse of the chains has been broken... The path, the true, the path to the truth will appear. Oh, does do these have to be knocked off or something? Cause she, she didn't knock them off earlier. I think that's what I actually. I, I think that's what we need to do here. All right, girl, come over here. Let her swing. Ugh. There we go. And we'll wait till she comes over here and do the same thing. Ow. Oh, okay. What? How did she miss? Um. Okay, well, at least we figured that part out. Oh, God, we're still really hurt, though. I don't think we can get hit again. Girl, come over here. Yeah. Go for it. Nope, go. F go! Damn it! Oh my god. Okay, we'll try again. I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, here we go again. <laughs> Chris, take Let's a try and do it correctly this time. Okay, you stay there. Um, Go for this. Ow. I meant this. Girlfriend. Come over here. I don't know what your name is. Medusa. What did she just do? This. Damn it. No, this thing. Come over here. Oh shit, what? Wait, what the fuck? Ah. Oh. Wait, am I supposed to? Come over here! Wait, am I supposed to knock her off or knock these off? She's not really knocking them off. She's just trying to swing at me. Damn it. Girlfriend, go for this. Ow! How did you hit me from that angle? Wait, she's not knocking it off, though. That's the problem. Oh, I'm supposed to do it? Oh, that would've been nice to know earlier. Okay, well, if she kills me again, at least I know I can do this myself. Um, 
So I don't. I, she's not even a factor in this. She's just here to make it harder. Okay. Well, now I know. <laughs> so that's good. Um, probably still have to get around. Oh, what? Mother. Oh shit. <gasps> oh no. Oh. Was that her mother's skull? Hello. I'll investigate this area a little further. Okay. Wait, wait, was that, wait, <laughs> was he saying I'll investigate this area a little further or I'll investigate this area and then to us a little further? Like you need to go a little further along. Like which one was it? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't really matter. Um, What's down here? Oh. What is this? Oh, it's an elevator. Oh, okay, so that's not the final boss. You know where this is probably gonna go, actually? This is probably gonna go right to the courtyard that we haven't been to yet. Yep. Yep. Exactly. What's this? There's a large iron door and it won't budge. That seems ominous. Um, what's all this over here? Hello? Hello? Wait, is this something I can look at? No. Um. What is, what, what am I doing? So. It won't, okay, what am I supposed to do? Why do I have the ink ribbons? <laughs> also, I should probably use this. Um, is there anything around that I can use or look at? No. Okay. What if I go back and talk to Wesker down there? Okay, so maybe that behind the iron door is going to be the final boss? I don't know. Something like that, probably. Um, I kind of want to die so I can do that like, over again. <laughs> Uh, I guess maybe I should ch check my, um, my item box. Okay. Well, I'll be back once I figure something out, I guess. Because I don't want to wait, make you guys wait. <laughs> okay, so I redid the fight. I didn't get hit this time. Well, I didn't, it wasn't really a fight. I just pushed the things off. But I also looked at this coffin, and apparently there's dialogue, or text here. Inside the coffin is a skeleton. Wait, there's something else. Uh... Family picture. Okay. Okay. It's a letter. To my Lisa. Day by day, I can feel my consciousness drifting further away. Oh, Lisa's the name of that fo the photo in that cabin in the woods. Uh, it was on the, fo the photo in the back. The shots given to me by men in white clothes made some of mommy's itching go away. Today, they gave me another shot saying it was nutrition. Oh, fuck when they give me the shots mommies when they give me the shots mommies can think straight but mommy's shocked and sad because mommy's unable to think of you all the time that's, that's scary mommy's afraid afraid of forgetting everything especially the memories of you and daddy what your faces look like how we used to be together they're all starting to disappear to somewhere dark in my mind oh lisa i wish i could touch your face and hold you in my arms right now so that I can hold on to our wonderful memories of you and daddy. Lisa, we can't stay here any longer. We have to escape. This is creepy. Listen to me, Lisa. Our chance to escape is the next time when we go to the lab together. We'll both pretend that we are both unconscious. And when that man in white clothes is off guard, that will be our chance. When we're on the outside, let's look for daddy together. Okay, sweetie? Be strong, Lisa. November 13th, 1967, Jessica Trevor. Ooh, my mom's name is Jessica. <laughs> That's kind of creepy. Um, okay. Uh, interesting. So apparently there's a mother and a daughter, and they lost their dad. All right, let's go up through the elevator. And I guess I'll try and go figure this out. Okay, so I figured this out a second ago. A circular depression, there's a wolf-shaped emblem carved inside. So we went back to the item box, 
And lo and behold, we have these two medallions that are shaped like a wolf and an eagle. So I feel like we're going to have to use both of them. Oops. I should have... Oh God, I should have selected and press use like I'm about to do. Yep. And yeah, that's pretty easy to figure out. Uh, I'm sure there's maybe there's one on the other side. I think... Is there one here? Uh... Hello? Uh... Uh... I feel like there should be one on this side too, possibly. I don't know. Hello? Oh, there we go. There we go, okay. <laughs> Let's put the emblem of the eagle in it. Or the eagle medal, whatever. Boom. Oh, cutscene. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, that's... Whoa, what the fuck just happened to the... <laughs> it looked like the fountain just kind of, like, emptied out. Uh, is the metal door open at all? It won't budge. Okay, um... Where do I go? <laughs> is there, like, a ladder in here or something? Because it looked like something opened inside of it. Is that it right there? Oh, yes it is. Um, okay, stairs. Oh wait, I think this is, oh yeah, this is an elevator. Yeah, okay. This is kind of weird. Oh shit. So maybe we come out of it through the iron doors or something? I don't know. Um, so I guess we're not done with the game yet. A huge elevator shaft. There's also what appears to be some kind of water storage tank. Oh, okay, that makes sense. So that's where the water went. Um, wait, where do we go? Wait, what? Oh, what the heck? Wait, where? Oh shit, am I supposed to go down from here? Uh. Okay, so wait, actually, I can probably go through these doors right here. And then I'll check out the other door and the ladder. I don't know. Oh! Oh, no! Okay, that goes back into the elevator. <laughs> okay, that makes a lot more sense, then. Uh, I did not realize that, what that was. Okay. Let's try and go... This... Oh, God. This way. This way? This way? This way, okay. <laughs> um, alright. Okay, there's a door here. Is this a door? Yeah, this is a door. Okay. The sign reads, Will not open unless in first class emergency. Okay, let's go down the ladder. I don't know what all this is gonna be, but... I feel like it'll be something similar to where the, sh where the sharks were. Oh shit. There's another, uh... No, wait, there's an ink ribbon right on the floor here. No, there's an ink ribbon on the floor! <laughs> Hold on. Okay, there's also an item box in this room. Oh, doesn't really matter anyways, but... There we go. Okay, yes, I will take this. Oh, there's three of them, so I'm gonna have to put them... ...in the item box after... Alright, let's save my progress. Uh, we're back to the top of it again. Okay. Lab entrance. Ooh. We're in a laboratory? Okay. Oh, this is like the lab in the note. Oh, shit. Okay, let's uh, open this up. Reorganize my inventory. Um, I guess I'll just have i'll take this and then i'll leave it at that so that we have some inventory space in case we have to do something with our inventory all right let's go inside this looks ominous <laughs> um kerosene uh there's probably gonna be zombies in here and stuff so 
Laboratory Basement 2. Okay. Is this oil on the floor or is this water? Oh shit! Eh, it's just a regular zombie. Who cares? Let's take this. Yeah. See, but I don't have any. Oh shit, there's a ton of zombies in here. And they all look like scientists. Alright, let's test this thing then. It's locked electronically. Um. Sure. Can I listen to it? No. Okay, so we'll just keep it then. Uh. Okay, I need to get around this zombie. Ah, shit. Let go. Bitch. <laughs> You're gonna explode in a second. Ah, let's not go back up, though. Let's try and stay away from it. Okay. Okay, we can go through here. <laughs> Sometimes when I'm, like, really stressed out, my, my uh, mouth gets dry and then it's hard to speak. Where are we? Um, okay. So we can go through here. Seems like there's a lot of locked doors, though. Oh shit, this place is gonna be really big, apparently. Oh my god, wait. <laughs> I didn't realize that was a door. I thought that was like a calendar or like a button panel or something. Where the fuck is this? So I guess we're gonna be down in this creepy laboratory for a bit. So that's fun. Uh sure, I don't know. Why not? Um Okay. Is this a computer? Researcher's letter. June eighth, nineteen ninety eight. My dearest Ada. By the time you read this letter, I will no longer be the person you once knew. The results of my test came out today, and as I suspected, it came out positive. I feel like I am teetering on the edge of reason just thinking about my impending doom. I would give anything not to have to become one of them. Uh, like a zombie? As far as I know, you were not infected. I sincerely hope things do not reach such a desperate pass, but if it has turned out that you are now the last person remaining alive, I want you to get the material from the visual data room. Then activate the self-destruct system in the power room and escape from here. Please do everything in your power to make this whole accident public. If everything is still running normally, you should be able to release all the locks using the security system. I have set up the terminal in the small security, security room so that you can log into the system using my name and your name as the password. You will need another password to release the lock of the door in basement level 2 where the visual data room is located. As a safety measure, I have coded that password into an x-ray picture of row and genogram. I know you and I'm sure you'll be able to work it out without any trouble. There's just one more thing and it is my last request. I hope you never have to lay eyes on me in this state, but if you do happen to run into me in my hideous form, I beg you to put me out of my misery. I hope you understand. Thank you, Ada. Yours truly, John. Oh, was that her father? John Ada. What? What's the significance of that? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, shit. An x-ray photograph. There's a name written at the top, Ed Fisher. Oh, shit. Wasn't there a, f a thing from him that I read about? I feel like there was, like, a, a note or something. An x-ray photograph is posted on the wall. There's a name written at the top, Alex Bechet. Uh, wait, I think I got one from him, too. Oh, shit, I didn't need to do that. Let's, I need to look at the name. Uh, Clark? Clark David! <gasps> wait a minute. Oh, shit. Wait a minute, I, th I feel like I recognize that name. Am I supposed to put this up here? Oh, sh no, no, no. Use. Okay. And there's another one over here. Uh, does that say Gail Holland? Why do I feel like a memo on the message board catches your attention? There's something scrawled on the notepad. To use the electronic door, place the initials in alphabetical order. Oh, okay. Place the initials in alphabetical order. Uh. Hmm, excuse me. 
Let's try that. Okay. Clark David. So he needs to go first. I think. Wait, what? What was the other photograph that was positioned? Alex Pshay. Oh, okay. That's perfect. That's perfect. Okay. Wait, so... Oh, no, no. Gail Holland needs to go last. Gail Holland needs to go last. Yes. Okay. Clark David. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay. Uh, no. What we do need to do... What we do need to do is... Oh, what? Uh... Who's here then? Ed Fisher. Wait. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. Yeah. Isn't that right? Oh, what? How did Gail Holland get all the way over here? Oh. Wait, so Clark David's over here? Okay. Oh, okay. So you have to look at two and then. Yes. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Um. A B. Uh. C D. And uh, no, not do that. And then E F. Okay. Oops. Let me do that. And. G H. Okay, perfect. I think I think the door should open now. <laughs> no. Okay. Um. Also, can we look at this computer here? No. Okay. Um. Then let's unlock the door. I'm assuming it means the electronic door that was at the beginning area. Up the. Oh, up the stairs. Damn it! I forgot about that. <sighs> Uh, okay. Well, we can't use either of these doors down this way anyways, so... We'll just wait on that. Um... I guess since I can open this door over... Oh shit, there's a zombie in here. Okay. This way. This is the way I wanted to go. Yeah, I think it's... I think it's upstairs. I think it's the... I think it was talking about the one upstairs. Probably have to go through in there to open the other doors down here. Okay. Yeah, let's take our slow ass time up these stairs. Jesus Lord. Is it open? What? I what? I, what? <laughs> Part of the desk is covered in what appears to be some kind of acid. Mm. Okay, is there another electronic door that can open then? I'm glad that the zombies are really slow. Check these doors down here. I mean, there's another one we can go through for sure. Because it's gray. And it's over this way. It's gonna get around this zombie. Okay. So we can go in here. Don't know what's gonna be in here. I don't know why, but this is reminding me of Pokemon. <laughs> when you get like to the bad organization, um, like headquarters. You know what I'm talking about? Ooh, are those Magnum rounds? Oops, I don't know why I did that. Uh... Wait, where are they? Part of a corpse lies on the operating table. That's lovely. Uh... There we go. I mean, I don't have them on me, but why not? <laughs> I need to get hurt. I mean, that's like a bad way to, uh... Think about... I you know, think about it, but if I get hurt, I'll have more inventory space. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Umbrella Computer OS RLPLS. Copyright Umbrella Core. Uh, I don't think I can do this at the moment. Oh, wait, do I have to? Or can I get out of this? What happens if I do this? Oops. Uh. I kind of doubt that's going to work. <laughs> okay. How do 
do I get out of this? Do I use the back? No. Do I use escape? Oh, I do. Okay, I just hit. You just hit escape, apparently. Wait, hold on. What's this? V A C T researchers note: There is now evidence that when the host loses consciousness, the body goes into a dormant state. During this time, the virus becomes active and rapidly transforms and reconstructs the basic composition of the body. The host eventually mutated into a humanoid creature. We call them the Axe. Its speed and amazing muscular development are particularly noteworthy. After transformation, it becomes more agile and aggressive. Already four of our researchers have died from trying to feed it, turning the place into an instant bloodbath. Ever since this tragic and barbaric accident, we have decided to call its kind Crimson Heads. Okay. That dangerous and precious prototype specimen can't be left there. We have to figure out a way to deal with it. Termination is definitely not an option. We finally decided to freeze the specimen and confine the body inside the basement of the backyard cemetery. Basement. Oh, is that the thing I fought under the grave? I think that's what that was. Um. Can I use these? A row of LCD monitors, they must, must once have been used to display something. Well, no shit. <laughs> Uh, on this computer over here. Can I look at this? Part of a corpse. Oh shit. Uh, is there something back here? Oh, what is that? That's kind of creepy. Wait, what's this over here? A variety of chemicals you've never seen before. Okay. Oh yeah, I'll take that. Uh, is there anything useful back here? The cadavers are frozen wrapped in body bags. That's really creepy. That's like extremely creepy. <laughs> um, okay, I don't know what the purpose of coming in here was, but I don't know what else to do. Um, because none of the other doors open at the moment. Like all of... Mm, uh okay we'll see i guess <laughs> we'll just go let's just go through here and see what we can do check all the doors and stuff stay away from the zombie too so we don't want to interact with that oh shit is there another one over here it's locked a symbol resembling a power area is carved into the lock okay oh shit hello hi don't want you. Okay, I didn't mean to pick that up. Where's the door? It's over here. That's not what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to look at the door. It's locked. A symbol or something. Okay, power areas, power areas. Got it. Oh shit, there's two. Shit. Load. Okay. Where's the other one? Hi. Okay. <laughs> I know he's gonna get back up, but I'm just waiting for it. Is he dead now? Okay, I think he's dead. I think I see blood, right? I mean, if he gets back up, then I guess he won't be dead. Uh, I think he's dead. <laughs> okay, um... Like I said, I don't know if it's a he, but I'm going to go over here and go in the store again and check these other doors. I'm pretty sure I did that puzzle, though, with the names correctly. Um, but nothing seems to be opening that wasn't already open. <sighs> At least there's a lot of stuff I can pick up later, like that first aid kit right there. It's locked. Oh, okay, that's all it says. Um, what's this? Oh, what the fuck? It's locked. If you can just get those levers on the side to work, it should open. Okay. Levers for releasing the door locks. Now, if you can just release the locks on the levers. Oh. Wait, aren't they... Aren't they released? 
Is this the... Is this the door that we was talking about? Uh... Okay, maybe not. I don't know. I don't know what's going on here. Where's the other room? Door's over here. Okay. Let's go back in here real quick. And just try and do this x-ray puzzle again. <sighs> okay. Oh wait, am I supposed to hit this? There's no kind of switch. Yes. Oh. Part of it is glowing red. That's creepy. It is glowing red. Okay. I don't like that. Uh... Okay. But they're in alphabetical order. No. Uh... Like, I feel like it should be right. <laughs> like, why? What? What is happening? I'm so confused. They're in order from A to H. Um, I don't- I don't know what to do. <laughs> John Ada. Uh. Something scrawled on the notepad. To use the electronic door, place the initials in alphabetical order. Oh! Oh! Count? Wait, what does that say on that? Count a way of leading. Alphabets. That's what that looks like it says. So, am I supposed to do it... Like, in this alphabetical order? And not the names of the patients? I think it's- I think I'm supposed to do it in the order of... What's glowing red. Okay. So... Okay, I'll just have to think about what each one is. So, that is, what is that? <laughs> I forgot that is, colon, okay, that's the colon. It's, it's the me, it's the colon, the colon. Um, okay. Uh, this is the spine? Wait, isn't that the esophagus? Yeah, okay, that's the esophagus. So you have the colon and the esophagus. So technically those are in alphabetical order. So, that's the liver, I know that, um, and the lungs, wait, colon, esophagus, liver, lung, that's in alphabetical order, what, wait, now I'm really confused, <laughs> what, what does that say? Lungs. So. Yeah, so the. Huh? Colon, esophagus, liver, lungs. That's in alphabetical order. Is there something else glowing red on these? No, it's just the colon here. Just the esophagus here. No. Just the liver. They're already in alphabetical order in every possible way. The lungs. Yeah, so... I'm so confused right now. Oh, shit. Didn't mean to do that. Damn it. Which one's, which one's even like, damn it. Ugh. Oh. Oh wait, so they were in the right positions. No, damn it. I didn't want to do that. Gail, oh, well I guess I did. Okay. No. Ed Fisher, all right, good. I think they're back in the, in the regular order. Yeah, okay. 
Um, is there like a switch I need to press or something to make sure that this is correct? Or, I mean, like, literally all that's here is this. So, colon, esophagus, liver, lungs. That's all I'm getting from this. Colon, pass To use the electronic door, place the initials in alphabetical order. I did that. Place the initials in alphabetical order. Count a way of leading alphabets. I, I don't know if that's unneeded or not. I don't know. I feel like this should be done. But I can't use the electronic door. No. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna leave this switch on. And I'm just gonna leave it like that. Right. So I think, okay, I think that's good. I think that's good. Maybe I just need to turn that switch on to, I don't, I, if, <laughs> I'm gonna test both doors again, but if this isn't correct, I'm gonna actually lose my mind. Are these good now? These are blinking now. Levers for releasing door locks. Now if you could just release the locks on the levers. What? Was that not right then? Um... Does this say it's an electronic door? Hmm... Okay, let's go back upstairs then and try it one more time and I'll be right there. Okay, uh, after thinking about this for a while I have an idea. And I think it might actually be this. Remember how it said John and Ada? I think, I think this is it. Um, and then Ada. A. Luckily, they're pretty simple names. A D A. Is that it? Oh my God, that was it. Okay. Uh, sure. Oh what? Um, okay, let me think about this for a second. Okay, so I've tried a lot of different methods, but I was thinking, um, maybe S-E-L-L, cell. Also, the cell's on the screen, but the reason I was thinking about this, how I came to the conclusion is the organs that were on the x-rays, um, in alphabetical order, it goes for each initial of the first, the first initial of the organ, um, if you take colon, esophagus, liver, lungs, it goes, it spells cell. So, let's try that. I don't know if it's gonna do anything. Mm. Hey, there we go! Okay, that unlocks that room. Okay, so that's good. Uh, so now we can actually walk into that room. What about this one? Oh, okay, I think that unlocked... Okay, it unlocked something. I don't I don't know where that is. Uh, I guess we'll see. Okay. Perfect. Now we can quit this. Okay. Um... Which room did that unlock again? Oh, it's the one in that hallway over there. Okay, so let's do both of those doors real quick. Okay, uh, this way. Luckily all the zombies are dead. I did kill them off camera. Or I killed one of them off camera, I think. The one upstairs. So all of them are dead. Uh, oh shit, I'm going the wrong way. Hold on. We go over here. This area is, like, this game makes going places very confusing. <laughs> uh, okay. I do have a rehearsal in 18 minutes for a radio show that I'm in, so I do have to wrap this up quickly, but I will do these two rooms very quickly. I don't think it'll take much longer. 
Alright, let's try out this room. Maybe this will get... Um, there's a solution here for getting the locks taken off the door over, out here. Um, okay, I can't pick up the ink ribbons. That's okay, though. Uh, this is also not ink uh, the typewriter room. I actually haven't found one of those now I'm thinking about it. Um, I kind of... Ooh, I'm gonna have to go back. Oh! Oh my god, let go of me. Let go of me. What the fuck, that scared the shit out of me. He just like grabbed onto me instantly. Also, this room looks very confusing. Ah! Oh my god. Okay, that works. I don't know why he didn't do it in the first place. Die. Um, here, let's... Oh, shit, not that, not that, not that. Let's use one of these. Okay, we're good now. you are gonna explode any second. Don't walk this way. Okay, good, he died. Okay, um... What is this? I don't know if I want to! <laughs> There's too many things! Um... I saw a paper over here, though. Yeah, it's glimmering. Facts. To Sanitation Division, attention, manager of sanitation. From Raccoon Disaster Contingency Committee. Isn't that what we are? Are we with Raccoon or something? The contents of this fax are confidential and intended for the named addressee only. Any copying or disclosure of the contents of this fax to any third party is strictly forbidden by the sender. After reading the contents of this fax, it must be destroyed immediately. We expect significant increase in the damage done by the recent T-Virus outbreak than initially estimated. There are several concerns. First concern, more than half of the researchers have been infected by the T-Virus and died. It has also been reported that among, almost all of the survivors of this accident are starting to show symptoms of the T-Virus infection. Second concern, our secret security patrol team has also been completely eradicated. Isn't that us? I don't know. Therefore, our most secret research is in danger of public disclosure. Quick actions are demanded to prevent mass media coverage. Third concern, there is a high possibility that most of the specimens are running loose inside the compound. We expect many casualties to follow. However, yet unfortunate, these casualties underscore the success of our research results. Actions must be taken to prevent our research results from being made public. We suspect the first official intervention will come from the state, police, and stars. That's us. That's on our uniform. We strongly recommend taking measure, measures against them first. Oh shit, they know that we're here though. Oh no. Oh no, that's not good. A security system passcode transmission device. If you had an MO disk, you could transmit- Oh! I do, I do, I do. Perfect. Let's use it. All right. Oh, is that gonna work on those? Oh. Transmitting the passcode seems to have unlocked something. It, so it unlocked one. Do I still have the thing? No, I don't. Okay, so I, I used that up. Um, wait, what is this over here? Looks like a cryogen chamber. There seems to be something behind this sturdy door. Yes, let's open it up. Warning, fuel may explode if shaken or jarred. Jesus, fuck. Okay. It looks like a refueling device. Um, I don't think I have anything for that at the moment. Oh wait. Wait, is there something moving on around here? What is that sound? Oh, it's just little bugs. Okay. What is this thing? Slide filter. Am I supposed to use that on this thing? Uh. No? Okay. I don't know what it's for then, but we'll take it with me. Um, and then I guess we'll go upstairs. Since we have a little bit of time. Or actually, I think we're coming right up on time. So I think I'll save that for the next one, actually. Uh, I'm gonna pause and then I'm gonna go right over to the save. Okay, I paused, but there's a fucking crazy zombie here with the, sl the slashers. Shit. Shit! Oh god, I need to run. Need to run, need to run, need to run. Oh shit, shit, shit. Fuck. 
Okay, it's not actually that fast, but it's still pretty scary. And it does a good amount of damage. I'm pretty sure. Right? Eh, okay, maybe not a ton, but... Oh wait, this is... I forgot there's a save right at the entrance here. Okay, that's good. Um... In that case... Wait, do I have anything in my inventory for saving? I don't. Okay. Um... Let's put these in here. And along with these. Um... And then let's get... The ink ribbons that we have. Oops. And then we'll save. Okay, I did not mean to do it that way, but that's fine too. Alright. It's an old typewriter. Yes, I will save. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like and consider subscribing to see more content like this. I'm hoping to uh, not have another huge hiatus like I did. I mean, I feel pretty settled in here right now. I, I felt pretty settled for a while. I just had some personal issues to deal with and just like work out on my own, you know, life. <laughs> but yeah, I'll uh, see you guys in the next one. Um, keep looking forward to this and other stuff. Bye.